What's up everybody, Danny's here and we are back at it again with another video. But before you get into it, make sure you check out all the links in the description below. And yes, we're having Tetris being added to the NES now that we have Donkey Kong Land 3 added already on the Game Boy and the Switch. So, why not add Donkey Kong 94 to the Nintendo Switch? Now, Donkey Kong 94 is a game for the original Game Boy. Now, basically, though, Donkey Kong 94 was released 30 years ago on the original Game Boy. And I feel like Donkey Kong 94 has, like, classic Ar Donkey Kong arcade games, like Donkey Kong, Donkey Kong Jr., and all the Donkey Kong arcade games. I mean, I believe that Donkey Kong 94 was actually, like, easily one of the best Game Boy games for the original Game Boy. But now... And if we take a look, we now have Donkey Kong Land 1, 2, and 3. I've noticed. Oh, nope. Okay, here we go. Here we go to Game Archives. See, Game Boy. Yeah, if we go to Nintendo Switch Online. Alright, now here we have three Donkey Kong Land games. That's really cool though, because Land represents like, it's like a reference to Super Mario Land for the original Game Boy. That's kind of cool though. That's kind of cool. I really like how Nintendo actually added in Land for the Game Boy, like Super Mario Land, Donkey Kong Land. It's kind of cool though. It's kind of interesting though, basically. Now here's the thing. Now I wanted to see Donkey Kong 94 added to the original Game Boy on the Nintendo Switch because we have Donkey Kong Land 1, 2, and 3. So now Donkey Kong Land 1 is Donkey Kong Country and Donkey Kong Land 2 is known as Diddy's Conquest and Donkey Kong Land 3 is known as Dixie Kong's Double Trouble. It's a really good game though. These, these games are really good. I highly recommend playing for the Nintendo Switch on the original Game Boy and on the SNES. I highly recommend it as well, though. Now, we also want Donkey Kong 94, but what I also want to see is Mega Man on the NES Nintendo Switch. I might do that in the next video because I was thinking that Donkey Kong 94 did, like, the original arcade game and then the NES game for the original Game Boy, and now they did Donkey Kong Jr. Like, they did, like, the Game & Watch gallery for the Game Boy Color, and that's what I've been knowing right now. So, as you guys know, Donkey Kong Land... I mean, not Land... I mean, Donkey Kong Land is a really good game, but I'm talking about Donkey Kong 94. Because Donkey Kong 94 is a really great game. I mean, Donkey Kong... I mean, like, all the Donkey Kong games I've been playing... I mean, I played Donkey Kong Country, which has been, like, 30 years of this game. Donkey Kong Country for the SNES. Yeah, okay. So, I noticed that Donkey Kong 94 takes place, like, New York City. In the, and it has, like, all the arcade games you can play on Donkey Kong 94. You can choose either Donkey Kong, the original arcade version, or the NES version, or Donkey Kong Jr., the arcade version, or Donkey Kong Jr. on the NES version. So... I think Donkey Kong 94 should be a really good game Nintendo should definitely add to the Nintendo Switch. Because honestly, there's some Game Boy games Nintendo they haven't added yet, and same with the NES games. But hopefully they'll add them to the Nintendo Switch pretty soon though. I mean, sometimes some of them are updated from time to time, apparently in the future though. But Nintendo might plan it pretty soon though, in the future, but also... I wanted to see that Nintendo would basically do like Theme Shop because I know a Theme Shop would be requiring a Nintendo Switch Online membership or a Nintendo Switch Online expansion pack. We may have to find out soon though because I'm thinking that Nintendo should really do all this. Just like what they did for the Theme Shop for the Nintendo 3DS. But I think... Now that we have three Donkey Kong Land games for the original Game Boy on the Switch, Nintendo should definitely add in Donkey Kong 94 for the Nintendo Switch because I think it's going to be a really good idea, though. It's going to be a really good idea if Nintendo adds to that game. But pretty much, though, that's going to be it for today's video. I really hope you guys do enjoy the video. If you do, make sure to hit that like button if you enjoyed the video. Leave a comment, share your thoughts in the comments below. 
Subscribe if you are new to the show. Make sure to hit that bell notification every time you get notified when I post a video. Thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you all next time.